I just got done uh, going for a jog. I basically, uh, I've stopped going to the gym for the time being during this coronavirus business. Um, not so much because I'm concerned for my uh, health, uh, but uh, what if there's some older people? I don't want to. I don't want to give to them and cause them to kick the bucket too early. Anyway, um, I was preparing some food at home. I would be hanging out there right now, but a friend of mine who I sold a house to recently, uh, she locked herself out of her house. So I'm about to go go let her back in and scuttle back to the house. But I just wanted to take a moment right now to kind of talk with you. Uh, there, I know there's a lot of people right now that are, uh, you know, they're bunkering down at home. They're, they're uh, maybe not working. Uh, maybe even some of their income has, has stopped. Maybe, maybe their only source of income has stopped uh, for the time being while they're, while they're being uh, socially distanced. And um, I wanted to just take this moment to encourage you as a, a, a group, as a society, that um, this can be a tremendous opportunity. Uh, as, you're, as you might be aware, as you might be uh, one of these people, it's very easy to get caught up in the, in the way of working and working all the time and hustling and going out and getting it. And then um, there is a tendency to get out of balance very quickly to lose sight of uh, the bigger picture, to um, you know, forget about you know having your quiet time or spending good quality time with your family, or reading books that you like. So this this next couple of months, where we might be asked asked to stay in our house, stay in our place, um, I want to encourage you to use this as an opportunity to do those things that you always say you want to do or the things that you always talk about wanting to do. You know, spending that quality time with your family, playing some board games, um, reading, turning on some music, uh, dancing in your house, uh, just meditating, praying. Take this opportunity to recalibrate, to rebalance yourself or to even go further than you've ever gone in, in, in areas that maybe you've neglected in your life. This is a great opportunity for healing. This is a great opportunity for mental and spiritual development. Uh, you, there's, there's so much stuff we can do. And, and especially, you know, especially seeing as we have uh, access, at least right now, to internet and, and electricity and things of that nature. You can educate yourself on almost any topic that you want. So pick up that book that you've been uh, neglecting. You know, talk, have that conversation that you've been wanting to have. Uh, spend that quality time with those loved people that you that you want. And um, and if you if you've been telling yourself you don't have time to meditate, or uh, you know, maybe this is that perfect opportunity to kind of initiate uh, your journey, initiate that practice. So there, there's, there's benefits to, to even a situation like this where we have some sort of pandemic across the world. Uh, you can, and I encourage you to, make the most of it. Don't let these opportunities pass you by uh, because this is, this is what life is of. This is what life is made of. These beautiful opportunities to find light inside of a dark situation and, and, and bring it out. That's my encouragement uh, for you today. I look forward for all of us healing and, um, and, uh, and evolving to the next level.